Hello and welcome to TFC. I am Naveen. In this video, let me take all of you back in time and reach the last week of 1973. That week, an 18-year-old young man from a small village in Kerala left for UAE on the ship called Dumra. Like many others traveling to a foreign land, he too had a desire to achieve something big. A week later, on 31st December, he arrived in UAE. At that time, he hardly had any money in his pocket. All he had was hope in his eyes and lots of dreams to fulfill. There in UAE, he faced hardships, living together with many other people in a very small room. During this scorching summer, they used to pour buckets of water on the floor just to survive. Amidst all this struggle, who would have thought that this young man would one day become one of the richest people in the world? His name is M. A. Yusuf Ali, the founder of the retail conglomerate Lulu Group International. His company now has over 57,000 employees, operates over 230 massive retail stores, and makes over 50. 56000 crores in revenue so let's quickly begin our journey and explore lulu groups massive business empire first we will travel to america and reach new jersey here we will find the 75000 square foot distribution center of lulu groups export company y international now moving to uk we will reach Birmingham here too the group operates a 124000 square foot export distribution center moreover in the uk the group also owns the property of the great scotland yard hotel which was once the headquarters of the scotland yard moreover yusuf ali has also acquired a 10% stake in a uk based trading company called east india company yes indians now own the east india company furthermore in scotland the group owns this landmark scot the property world of astoria and also the property of intercity hotel in zurich switzerland moving to egypt here the group operates three hypermarkets including the newest 8700 square meter hypermarket in new cairo from cairo let's travel to southeast asia here we will find lulu hypermarket and grocery store in malaysia and fai hypermarkets in nearby indonesia now let's move to the ever changing uae The country is now famous for its grand shopping malls like Al Wahda Mall, Khalidia Mall, Mushrif Mall, Madinat Mall. Okay, I have already said the names of many malls, but let me complete this list very fast. There is Al Raha Mall, Mazia Mall, Al Fouha Mall, Barari Mall, UAE Mall, Al Dafra Mall, Arke Mall, Lulu Mall. So what do all these malls have in common? Yes, you guessed it right. They all are developed and operated by Lulu Group. Moreover, the group has developed shopping malls in Saudi Arabia, Bahrain, Qatar, and Oman. Moreover, in Oman, the group co-owns the five-star hotel property, Sheraton. in Oman Hotel in Muscat and also Pullman Downtown Hotel in Dubai now finally it's time to return to India here the group owns malls in Kochi Bengaluru Tiruvananthapuram Thrissur and a soon to be opened mall in Lucknow moreover Lulu Group operates export facilities in Uttar Pradesh and Mumbai and has developed a tribute portfolio hotel in Kochi and is developing six more hotels across India furthermore the group also owns Lulu International Convention Center in Thrissur and also has developed Asia's largest convention center in Kochi. Lulu Group and its founder M A Yusuf Ali have also been involved in multiple social causes that include earthquake relief, flood relief, providing meals and the group has also adopted schools. While M A Yusuf Ali has also been bestowed with Padma Shri from the government of India and he has also received Abu Dhabi's highest civilian Award. This journey of a young man achieving unbelievable success in a far away land will certainly inspire many people. So in the end, all I can say is this is Lulu Groups and Yusuf Ali's massive business empire.